Hey everybody and welcome back to Investment Hunting where we talk about various crypto projects. Before we begin, I want to let you know that I'm not your financial advisor. I do not provide financial advice on the channel and I don't even encourage you to invest. But what I am going to do is share with you my own personal opinion and views on the projects discussed on the channel. So with that said, we are looking at uh, Life Changer. So this is a, um, a token that uh, is supposed to be having, as they say up here, the biggest pre-sale ever, 2,500 uh, BNB soft cap and a 5,000 BNB hard cap. Now, um, a pre-sale link has not been released on this project yet, um, so I do want to make you aware of that. They did have an audit. It has been audited, passed with no higher medium severity issues. The dev is photodocs, you know, in the white paper, so we'll take a look at that real quick. So this is the white paper. Um, we can see here that the dev is photodocs, you know, there. All right, and then um, no KYC. Uh, and then I'm going to leave a link for you in the description as far as like what's coming to the project. So it explains everything there in that Telegram message. As far as like any concerns and red flags I've got on this one, the team mentions app development in the roadmap. But um, no, no specifics actually provided regarding the app. The app is the only mention of any kind of sort of development utility associated with the token. They've got less than 10 followers in their Twitter at the time of scouting the project, less than 100 members in the Telegram at the time of scouting the project. Roadmap ends in December. We're going to take a look at that. And they say they've had other successful projects, you know, but I haven't seen any details mentioned regarding those projects, you know. So if the team comes across the video, uh, it'd be great if they could, you know, uh, shed some light on some of these things that I've mentioned. I'm always, always all about you know, trying to make sure I'm providing the most accurate information to my audience. And so always welcome teams, you know, to leave me any comments so that if there's something that they would like to dispute or provide clarity on, uh, they can certainly do that, um, you know, through uh, just messaging me. So, uh, so this here, life changer, millions in transactions, millions in reflections, millions in marketing, millions in liquidity equals millions in opportunity then we get a white paper button here i do like this warren buffett quote if you don't find a way to make money while you sleep you will work until you die um i actually agree with that you know so um let's see here they provide some information here uh, life changer has been created to provide an endless stream of income to our valued holders the ecosystem is based upon automatic rewards and lp acquisitions and are advantageous in crypto as it generates rewards by holding the life changer token while generating passive income. So with an experienced and successful team with a proven track record of producing token projects rising over three to eight X of pre-sale values after launch, they are determined to see where to set a new bar and smash all previous records. So again, would love to get some more information regarding the team and their track record. What projects have they done that have three to eight X offer pre-sale values after launch. I don't have any of those details. So it'd be great if the team could chime in and give us those project names and their charts, um, you know, and obviously just proving that they were the team behind uh, those projects. Um, you know, because like I said, if you're going to make these kind of claims, I just think that it would be helpful in the way of transparency to provide that information, you know, so that, uh, so that we can see what that is. So uh, with Pink Sales largest uh, 2,500 soft cap, 5,000 hard cap pre-sale event, life changer is an opportunity you cannot miss. On tokenomics, we see 3% going to reflections, 3% to liquidity, and 3% to marketing. So they got an airdrop, you know, total rewards going to be 500,000 LIFE and 500 BUSD. So we get top 1,000 winners, you know, are going to get 500 life tokens and $100 BUSD to the five most active. So that's going to be running from the 30th of August to September 6th. And then they got a button here where you can join their sweep widget. So, um, yeah, I'll just leave it. I'm not going to open it up. But uh, join the biggest pink sale uh, pre-sale ever. So we got a button here for the audit, button here for KYC certificate. These are not linked because yeah, I can click on both of them, but they're not linked to anything uh, yet. So I'll be looking forward to seeing you know, that KYC certificate. 
Now on the roadmap, this is what I was mentioning before. So we can see August, you know, we're in August right now, token deployment, audit KYC, Solstice website pre-sale. And then in September next month, uh, we're looking at launch, massive marketing, 10,000 holders, 10 centralized exchanges, celebrity endorsements, you know, phase one of app development. Now, if we're looking here, okay, this is what, the 28th of August right now? And they're saying they're going to be launching in September of 2022. We don't get an exact date, but um, as far as the launch is concerned, here's my problem. My problem is you only have 10 followers on Twitter, and you got less than 100 members in your Telegram. So I don't know how the launch is going to go. And if you're talking about us being literally in the last three days you know, of the month in August, and depending on when you launch here, how are you going to go ahead and build up your, your socials, your, your communities in a big way, you know, where it's going to lead to this, you know, massive, you know, launch. So what's the marketing going to look like? You know, um, are you doing, you know, basic telegram marketing? Are you doing, you know, more conventional marketing? Um, the 10,000 holders, this is aspirational. I mean, everybody wants to go to their holder accounts. I talk about this on several videos. 10 centralized exchanges. Are you in conversations, you know, with centralized exchanges already? Um, again, this is an aspirational number. And I've seen a ton of projects where, you know, they're talking about maybe one centralized exchange. You know, this one's talking about 10. So, you know, I'm skeptical here. I'm just going to say that, you know, out loud. Uh, celebrity endorsements, you know, who are we looking at here? Phase one of app development. Again, no details in regards to what the app is, um, not on the website, not in the white paper, not in the telegram. Haven't seen any details in regards to what on earth is going on with app development. October 22, we see massive marketing. Again, what's the difference between the marketing here and the marketing here? Otherwise, this is just fluff and just bloating uh, this phase you know, in, the, in the roadmap, and you just really don't need it. You don't need this either, 25,000 holders. Um, in a month, growing from 10 to 25, um, I'm just not sure. You know, again, it'd be nice to know exactly what's your plan to do that. Um, another 10 centralized exchanges, so you're talking about 10 or 20 total centralized exchanges. We also don't know if you're talking about low tier, high tier, no idea. But again, more aspirational. So all of this, all of this right now, uh, with the exception of massive marketing, which I believe is just a duplicate, um, is just it's 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 aspirational. Celebrity endorsements, you're repeating it, you know. So what's different here between here and here? Completion of the app. We still don't have any information in regards to the app. And social reach, uh, you know, again, it's more it's more fluff. Uh, it's not something that needs to be on the roadmap. And we don't, you know, and even when we look at this, this roadmap, okay, so it's nice to know that we get, you know, the, the, the year and the month, right? But we don't see whether they're going to be updating this roadmap of V2. We don't see really any utility. Um, they say they've got app development, but I don't see anything beyond that on this roadmap at all in terms of utility. Which, which tells me you don't really have anything that's going to make you know, anybody want to hold on to the token, which makes it a, a short-term hold you know, for anybody that would be willing to uh, engage with this project. We also don't see anything that's indicating what's already been completed or where you're at in terms of development right now of the project. So, and then we get you know, events here. You know, they want to shatter new milestones. Various events will be held worldwide. We, didn't, we get no details in terms of any events. We just get targeted cities, but no information regarding um, what these events may be. You know, so, and that's just super general in my personal opinion. So, I mean, this is, uh, and again, this is the white paper, but this is the life changer token. And uh, my personal opinion is that there's just too much generalized information, um, you know, on this project. And they really need to do a better job of providing more specifics. Um, you know, and that's everything from the white paper to what they're communicating, you know, on their actual website. So um, if the team sees the video and wants to weigh in, you know, on this, feel free. I'm always willing to have that conversation. So, but guys, that'll do it for me on the Life Changer token. I uh, thank you so much for watching. And with that said, I will leave the links relevant to the project in the description below. And you all enjoy the day.